And this is the Go Home Dynamite for the Revolution at Pay-Per-View. And uh, they're back in this show. We not only have a casino battle royal for a spot in the tag team title match at Revolution, but we also have a face of the Revolution ladder match. Both of these on Dynamite this week. We have the All-Atlantic Championship being defended. We have the FTW Championship being defended. And then we have a number of other matches and and interview segments. So for the face of the Revolution ladder match, winner gets a future title shot. We have got the debut of Commander. We've got Takeshita, Ortiz, Action Andretti, Sammy Guevara, Powerhouse Hobbs, Eddie Kingston, and A.R. Fox. Obviously, unless there is a, uh, unless, well, I mean, we, we probably will have a title change, my guess is, at, uh, at the pay-per-view. But the winner of this match is going to face the winner of Samoa Joe versus Wardlow, which my guess is probably will be Wardlow. And, you know, when I look at the lineup here, probably going to end up being, one would think, a heel. And really, there's a lot of baby faces in this match, with the exception of Sammy Guevara and Powerhouse Hobbs. Eddie Kingston's kind of walking that line in, in storyline. But, uh, you know, I, months ago, when they did that, that, uh, that three-way match, I said Hobbs should have won that match. Now, here's the thing, okay? Old Hobbs, they've been doing all these Book of Hobbs deals. It's time to pull the trigger on this dude. Now, there's actually two ways that you could pull the trigger on this dude. Way number one is he wins the face of the Revolution ladder match, and he ends up beating Wardlow down the line for that TNT title. I'd be fine with that. I think some people would argue, ah, oh, you can't have Wardlow win that belt back and then just lose it. Well, you know what? We've learned, at least I've learned, you can do anything you want. I mean, you can argue about it, but you can do anything you want because this is all pretend. <laughs> like, there's storylines and bookers, and you can choose who wins and loses. So, actually, you could do that. Wardlow could win the TNT title, and then he could lose to Hobbs. And life would continue on in professional wrestling, and everything would be all right. Knock, knock, who's there? Ric Flair. Ric Flair who? No, Ric Flair who? <laughs> I didn't get that one. <laughs> <laughs> knock, knock, who's there? <laughs> Bailey. Bailey who? We Bailey made it home in time to watch SmackDown That's Live. That's not how my jokes work! <laughs> we Bailey? What does that mean? She's small? It's we barely made it home. Oh, we barely made it. <laughs> oh your Invisalign made you dumb. <laughs> Why did the referee referee's feet smell when he was working? Because he was a dude doodle. <laughs> what? <laughs> because he was a doodle. His feet smelled because he was a doodle. Yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> what? See, these, these, these are so dumb that they're funny. Am I high? I don't. I, I drove here. I think I was sober when I got here. If you enjoy these videos, for just seven dollars and ninety nine cents per month, you can enjoy full length editions of the Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm. The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.